Hey, hey, it's episode 168 of Inside 300, bringing you your Disney and Universal news in just three minutes. I'm your host, Brian Perry. What do you say we kick things off over at Epcot to see someone blatantly breaking the most important rule there is on a roller coaster? The popular Guardians of the Galaxy Cosmic Rewind attraction experienced some technical difficulties, leading to this woman escaping from her harness and straight up just walking off of the coaster train. Because why? Why do we even have rules? She said, forget my hands, arms, feet, and legs. I'm taking my whole body out of the vehicle. If you listen closely, you can hear the sheer terror in the cast member's voice speaking over the intercom. Uh, please remain seated. Please go back to your vehicle. You gotta come get there her. Will be a cast member with you shortly. Go back to your vehicle. Now, according to Bailey Page, who took and posted the video, the ride had been stuck for at least 20 minutes at that point, and there was no telling how much longer these guests were going to be stuck. But guess what? It doesn't matter because this is obviously forbidden and highly dangerous. Not to mention that the woman got off on the part of the ride where you get, spoiler alert, reverse launched. Can't wait for our not top 10 guests behaving badly video that I now have to make. On to Universal, as Universal Studios Hollywood has made a huge announcement regarding its popular Halloween Horror Nights event that takes place from September through October. The Last of Us, the popular video game turned HBO hit show, will be a featured house that guests can walk through. The announcement comes with this new teaser that you're seeing on your screen now. Universal made sure to stress that the experience is based on the game and not the series from HBO, though I thought the series starring Pedro Pascal did a pretty good job mimicking the game, so I don't really see what the difference will be. In other Universal news on the East Coast and Universal Orlando Resort, one of the coolest meet and greet opportunities I've ever seen has begun. And the best part, you don't even need a ticket. Well, you need a parking pass. Universal City Walk is currently hosting an opportunity to meet Dr. John Hammond, AKA the man responsible for creating Jurassic Park. The rare opportunity is in honor of JP's 30th anniversary. Great stuff, Universal. Speaking of holiday events, a new one is coming to Hollywood Studios at Walt Disney World. Titled Disney's Jollywood Nights, the event seems to be a fancier spin on Mickey's Very Merry Christmas Party. It'll feature live Yes music in the Brown Derby restaurant and a soiree at the Tower of Terror. Very fancy. Finally, Pixar's 27th animated feature comes out this week. Can you believe it? 27! As Elemental hits screens. Even though that's barely touched the surface, Pixar is already advertising their 28th film, which will debut in 2024. The 28th movie is titled Elio and follows a boy who gets pulled into space after being mistaken for the leader of Earth. My immediate reaction to the trailer includes a bit of hesitation. I like that it's an original story and all, but uh, going right back to the setting of space after Lightyear was literally your last film seems a bit overkill in my eyes. Doesn't feel fresh enough to me. Elemental, though, looks great. I will see it eventually. That's going to do it for this episode of Inside 300. If you like what you saw, be sure to subscribe. Click that bell icon. Hello, bell. This way you're notified every time we come out with brand new content. I'll see you this Sunday for episode 19 of Disney 100 Jeopardy. Until then. Bye-bye.